First, there was the Wonder Box. It helped people cut back on their electricity costs by cooking and storing food for up to 12 hours. It was often time consuming and cumbersome to use and store. It was used less and less and eventually the fad ended. Enter the 21st century and the Wonder Bag has taken on a more sophisticated approach to the Wonder Box. It is actually recycled polystyrene which we've redesigned into a bag. So it is a um, you, it's, it looks great, it's topical, it's funky. With various exquisite designs in different sizes for all occasions, the Wonder Bag, a United Nations accredited product, is fast drawing in people who want to cut down their energy consumption. In an average household, um, you will use five litres of paraffin in a normal week. With the Wonder Bag, you're using a litre and a half. It also curbs the issue of deforestation because less firewood is needed if you're using the Wonder Bag. From a cooking point of view, a Wonder Bag can do exactly what a conventional slow cooker can do, but it uses a fraction of the electricity. Great. I'm going to grab one of these. Let's put it to the test. Let's actually go and cook something. A cooking lesson from me. A cooking wow. lesson. Come on, <laughs> All right. Well, let me explain to you. You need a source of heat to start with. If you're cooking, for instance, a stew, a meat stew, you would get it ready on your stove, whether it's a, a paraffin stove um, or a fire. You bring your food to the boil. As it starts to boil, you take it off the source of heat, put out the fire and put it into the Wonder Bag and it cooks at just below boiling temperature for up to four hours. Awaiting the results, albeit with skepticism, we then set out to uncover what goes into making the bag, which doesn't only have an incredible energy-saving capacity, but has potential to alleviate grinding rural poverty. This is what inspired Moshimbate, director at the factory where the bags are manufactured, to get involved. We have done a pilot with the informal settlement. We actually donated there over 200 cooking bags. Mm. They are saying they are using now almost half the paraffin they used to use. And also, they're not worried that when children come back from school, the shack will be bent because they boil the food, put it in the cooking bag, working mothers go to work, children come back from school, and the food is ready. For the women who struggle from day to day to afford the paraffin and electricity to cook their meals, it's been life-changing. It has helped me a lot because it's easy to use. That's why every time I use the Wonder Bag, I am energized because I can put the food on the stove and the Wonder Bag does the rest. Hours later, we await the big reveal while asking, does this really work? The proof is in the pudding, and in this case, the chicken. Steaming and ready to eat, turns out the Wonder Bag is just that, a wonder. Janet Mbogwa, E! News, Johannesburg.